KPRC2 is your vaccine central. This morning, we are continuing to gather the latest information from every county in our area about where and when more appointments will open up. KPRC2's Brittany Jeffers joining us live in Galveston County with the very latest. Brittany, good morning. Good morning. Well, it is important to note here that many counties have now launched these online waiting lists, the most recent here in Galveston County. Health officials say they're hoping that this is going to help to streamline the process, but we have found out that some surrounding counties have had some issues with either the online or the phone registration process. The portal to sign up for the COVID-19 vaccination is up and running in Galveston County. Representatives with UTMB tell me right now there's no limit or cutoff to the number of people who can join the wait list. But if you don't have access to the internet, the county set up a phone bank line. Over in Harris County, the numbers are growing. As of 5 o'clock on Wednesday night, more than 100,000 people pre-registered. If you run into problems online, you might want to check your browser. The county posted this under the registration tab, saying the app isn't compatible with Internet Explorer or Microsoft Edge at this time. Montgomery County, along with St. Luke's Health, the Woodlands Hospital launched a community drive through vaccination site. Hospital officials say they plan to administer 1,950 doses this week to health care workers, first responders, and high-risk individuals who previously completed the waiting list form. Chambers County also has a drive through vaccination clinic today. Scott Rothenberg tells me he's trying to get there. His wife had a 930 appointment, and this is what the line looks like. And there was a line of traffic that did move. I'm looking at ways now the line may go as much as a mile, mile and a half behind us in addition to what's in front of us. The county recently posted this on the health department website stating that the phone system is currently overwhelmed. It did check in with Scott Rothenberg, who I was speaking with on the phone. He tells me they are still waiting in line. We also want to point out that uh, that clinic was for people who had pre-registered. Now, focusing back here in Galveston County, health officials say they anticipate that they will vaccinate about 2,000 people on Friday and then another 2,000 people on Saturday at a drive through vaccination clinic at Walter Hall Park. Reporting live in Galveston County, I'm Brittany Jeffers, KPRC News.